what is up beautiful people it's me tara j back again with another one and today i am closing out teachers appreciation week with the unboxing ungifting whatever you want to call it with all the gifts that my students gave me it was so nice i was so surprised this was probably one of the coolest greatest first teacher appreciation weeks ever like one of my students she literally brought me something every single day so that's super dope um so yeah but before we get into that i do want to make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel so go ahead right now subscribe to my channel don't wait and hit the bell right next to the subscribe button so you know every time i post a video okay all right, guys, so we're going to jump right into it. I'm going to show you guys everything that I have from Teachers Appreciation Week. It's crazy cool. I'm super happy that I, I'm super happy to be a teacher just simply in general. So just to be able to, um, my eyebrows, everything is just rough. Excuse me what I look like. I just get out the shower and I thought, let me put these <laughs> sunflowers back on my head just to look a little bit cute up on here for you guys. But yeah, I want to do this real quick. So, because I want to start opening this stuff up and using it. So, yeah, or just getting it out the way so I can get this video out the way. Because I don't want to prolong it too long. So, let me just go ahead and knock that out. So, for starters, I'm going to start with all the pictures that was drawn for me. Okay? So, these are all of my pictures. Like, when I say I have a picture, I have literally like my whole sketch. I, I have a sketchbook of appreciation pictures that I've actually gotten all year. So I'm probably going to end up doing a video just showing all of the pictures that the students have given me all year. But we're going to just start off with these for now, just because I received them specifically this week. So, yeah, um, this is one of my students. She made this for me. This is a, a different color flag heart. And it's flags and it's heart. And she wrote this for me. She drew this for me, I believe, yesterday. Today's Friday. I'm not sure when she gave this to me, but this week. And I thought it was super adorable. So I thought, let me save it and keep it. She gave me this week. She was super happy to make it. She was super excited. And she's like, oh, Ms. Moore, Ms. Moore, look, I got this for you. It's so cute. I made this. It's for you. You can have it. And I was like, oh, thanks. So she made that for me. And then she also made this one. She said it was ice cream. It was a like strawberry ice cream. Although <laughs> strawberry ice cream isn't Ms. Moore's favorite, but she did just draw it. Maybe I think it's her favorite. I can't remember. <laughs> I really can't. I'm not even lying. And it says to Ms. Moore, I love you. Like, oh, like I really have students that really love me. Like it's crazy. It's so funny because another teacher came into the classroom and he was just like, wow, they're so happy. They are so happy. And that literally makes me feel good just to know that I have a class full of students that when someone comes in the classroom, they really see the amount of joy that they have on their face, just being there with me and just super happy. So I'm happy about that. Just moving on. Another thing, me and one of my artist students, because he's super dope at drawing, he um, looked at my computer. We looked up a picture of Scarlet Witch because we're always talking about um, WandaVision or we're talking about Marvel I had to put him on this new show called Invisible. Even though he may be too young to watch it, he came to school today like, Miss Mar, why didn't you tell me it was bloody and grishes and stuff like that? I was like, I told you it. You might have been too young for it. But he still enjoyed it. And he ended up drawing me the Scarlet Witch after we <laughs> looked it up on the computer. It took him literally about 20 minutes to draw this. I was like, you got to stare at it for five minutes and then you got to go try to remember what it, you looked at on the computer and then draw it. So this is what he came up with. And I thought this was super, 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 super cool. And yeah, I'm going to add that to my collage. And then I have another one of my students, she drew me this. She, she gave me this to show her appreciation. Most of my letters, they always talk about how they love me. I love you. I love you. I love you. So I cannot wait till the end of the year. And I'm just going to go crazy all out for all of them, just showing them how much I love them and how excited for the third grade I am for them because I'm just going to turn around and I'm going to see them again the following year. So stay tuned for that tea. And um, yeah, another one of my students, she uh, made me this. It says, I love you. You are the best. I'm the best. Okay. <laughs> so that is so cool. Again, I'm in second. I'm in the second grade. So of course... 
the kids love to draw, love colors, love markers, all that cool stuff. So I love this. This is super, 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 super dope. So moving on from all of the sketches and stuff, we're gonna go into like little things, okay? All right, guys, we are now moving on to the next gifts that I have. I actually missed a gift. I'm, I cannot remember when she gave me this because she's always like <laughs> drawing me pictures and giving me stuff and telling me she loves me. She's like one of my favorite girls. These are actually her sunflowers on my head that I took. But yeah, she drew me. She We were making um paper airplanes and she gave me this from Kai to Ms. Moore. I love you. Hi. It's just so cool how they just... It's just like so cool. Like I cannot wait to make, I'm gonna put like all of these papers and like frame them and just hang them up in, in my apartment when I move. <laughs> but I'm gonna try to do something like really, really dope with them just so I can have them for like ever. So stay tuned for that. It may take a while, but stay tuned for it cause I'm gonna have them forever. Don't, don't trip, I'm gonna have them forever. My lips is like crazy dry. I did just get out the shower, so hold on y'all. Okay, I'm back. Still looks kind of dry, but oh well, it's not. But anywho, another student, she got me. It was so nicely wrapped. It was like it was a present for Christmas. And when I was doing it, I did my, we do show and tell on Fridays. Well, I tried to remember, but I don't ever remember every single Friday. So somebody's supposed to remind me, but they don't even remember either. So she ended up gift wrapping this for me. She knows that I can never remember anything. So she got me this card. It says teacher. And then on the inside, it's like a pop-up. It pops up like, like congratulations. Like kind of like a graduation kind of thing. It says to my brilliant, one of a kind, super amazing teacher. Congrats. <laughs> so, so, so cute. So I was laughing at her today because you see how I said teacher twice already, right? Her note in the back here, it says, Miss Moore, you are the world's, she spelled world's wrong, <laughs> best de de he he her. <laughs> it's like, how did you spell teacher wrong? And it's listed like right on the front of the car and on the inside. So I was cracking up laughing at that. She thought it was so funny too. She's like, I, I forgot I was writing so fast and it was just, oh my God. So I was like, it's okay. I'm gonna keep it still. And then she got me this because of course, Ms. Warren can never remember anything. So this is an up close view of it. So one of them I'm gonna have on my refrigerator because I believe, oh, I just noticed that it's not magnet so I can't put it on my refrigerator, but whatever, I'm still gonna use it. One of them is on-duty teacher notes. Then the other one is off-duty teacher notes. I think this is super dope because I can use one at school every day. And then I can use the other one on everyday life. Like things like scheduling my YouTube videos or just check off lists. Did I pay this bill? Did I do this? Did I do it? Did I go to the gym? All of that good stuff. I could just use this and I just, I just love this. This is super, 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 super cool. I wish I can figure out a way to be able to stick it on my refrigerator because this is cool for groceries, all of that good stuff. So I think this is super, super dope. And then moving on from that, we're going to go tap it in, tap into the gift cards. I end up getting gift cards, a bunch, a bunch, a bunch, a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of gift cards. So the starting with, I got a Target gift card. It's a Visa gift card just to say thank you. And I can't even believe it. Oh, I, of course, I couldn't spend it because I had to do this video. I was just about to say, I can't even believe that I, I just literally just left, left Target. But whatever, I'm going to use it the next time I go to Target for sure. I got a $25 Target gift card just to say thank you. I think that's super dope. I got a, um another gift card from Target to Miss Moore. Uh, I'm trying to think. One of my students gave me that one. And then a young, a young lady gave me that one. And then a young man gave me this one today. He also brought me a red apple. I don't know. I told you guys about that in another video. He brought me a red apple. I always wanted to experience that. And then he bought me a, um, flowers. Real white roses, real white roses flowers in a little cool vase. I left it at work, but if you want to check it out, here's the video here. for 
right? <laughs> and then the balloon in the video, the young lady that brought me something every single day, one of those days she brought us balloons and I thought, yay, so cool. So I love that he also, but the gun, he also gave me this. Um, the same young lady who brought us something in every single day. Sorry that the camera is moving. I'm literally holding it with my hand. She also bought the super, super, super cute Starbucks gift cards. I haven't been to Starbucks in a long time. Please excuse the fact that I need to fill in because it's like extreme. I went in there twice and they were extra packed. And do I look like I'm waiting 45 to a minutes to an hour just to get my nails done for two hours? Uh, no. But um, yeah, this is a Starbucks and it's shaped like a pencil. And she was so, she thought it was so cool that it was a pencil. She just kept telling me, Miss Moore, Miss Moore, look at it. It's a pencil, it's a pencil. And I was like, well, okay, cool. <laughs> and then another young lady, she gave us some Domino's gift cards. Domino's clearly is Dunkin' Donuts, but yeah, there's that. Dunkin' Donuts gift card. So I got crazy amount of gift cards. And then another young man gave me a gift card. Super cute. It's in a um, blue envelope because his favorite color is blue, but he's so funny. Like, he the one that I'm always talking about. It's not Cameron, but it's another boy that's like crazy funny. And he's like, a day without one. Yeah, yep, yeah, that's it. Perfect. They, they just be knowing me. They know me. <laughs> Their parents know me too. But it says, a day without one isn't over yet. Super cute. <laughs> and then he too gave me a Target gift card. I'm finna, I finna run it up on Target. I'm finna run it up. I show him. <laughs> I don't know how much is on here, so I'm gonna check that out. Oh, it might be $50 on here. D, they bought out. But yeah, so there's that. Dang. Um, the inside of the car doesn't say anything. It's just on the front, and then the card fell out. So there's all of my gift cards, like all of my little things, my cards, my gift cards, my pictures and stuff like that. So moving on to everything else. All right, guys. So this is the final finale of everything that I received. So this is a, a little cubby, a storage bin per se. Well, it is a storage bin, so there's that. But uh, it says best teacher ever. Like I literally love this and I'm probably gonna, I wanna have it in my house, but of course I'll have it in my classroom thumbnail. Okay, so I literally love this and I cannot wait to use this. Like literally, like I'm gonna be using this for like when I take stuff home, I have to take work home. I'm always taking work home, but it is the end of the year. So I'm probably not gonna have to take that much stuff home, but I did take some home, stuff home today. So I'm probably gonna just walk in the classroom with this and they're gonna be excited that I um used it, <laughs> okay? So then after that, again, sorry that the camera is like going all over the place. It's because I'm literally holding it in my hand on my stand. The next thing I got, like this, like I said, one of the young ladies, she brought something in every day for us. And she brought us this bag. This is the last bag that she brought us today. Filled with all kind of cool goodies. So for starter, she got me <laughs> some Reese cups. So, Cause literally every single day or every once a week, probably or twice a week, I got Reese cups that they end up eating. I don't even end up eating it. They end up begging for it and I end up giving it out. So I'm like, she know I love Reese Cups anyway. So she got me these, which is super cool. She got me some tissue. I need, all of this stuff is literally stuff that I need inside of my car. So that's a come up. She gave me tissue. She got me some hand sanitizer, which is cool. She got me some little lotion. She got some Clorox wipes. She got, um, the last thing she got was this mask. It says, teach, teach, love, inspire. She claims she made this, but no, she didn't. <laughs> oh, but she swear she did. And I was like, okay, girl, 
you know, trying to show her love. But I, you know, I know the truth. I know the truth. So this is super dope. She gave me all that. And then another young lady came in today. Man, you, she, first of all, let's talk about this bag, though. I'm going to be reusing this for sure. But anyway, she came in today. It says, Miss Moore from Macy. Loved it. It smelled, when I say it smelled amazing, like a amazing like i like i'm not gonna say i never smell nothing that amazing but I, I could not stop putting my face in it just to smell the scent of it so of course like i said the students know me so well she ended up getting me this um foaming bath soap bath salt is lavender lavender and chamomile scent is relaxing care it smells so wonderful. I'm not, I'm really like, this is what I was talking about in my um, teacher diaries video that I am going to still use this, but if I break out in highs and you don't see me in about three, four weeks, here's why. Because I am, well, I was allergic to Dove growing up and I wasn't really using it because it always broke my body out and me moving on, whatever. And now she brought, she gave me some Reed diffuser cum lavender and sage with made with essential oils. Look at that. And guess what? It comes with a candle. I'm not even lying. I'm not even lying. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. Y'all gonna see. Y'all gonna see. I'm trying to hold it <laughs> at the same time. So y'all can see I ain't there. Do you see? Do you see it? Do you see? Look at that. They they are they come together. And when I say it smells amazing, like amazing. This could be a cool thumbnail too. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, all of this good all of these goodies came inside of that super cute glittery pink purple bag. And yeah. That is literally everything that I got from Teachers Appreciation Day. This is weak, really. This is everything, and I'm super excited, and I'm super happy that I was able to actually experience this. I love the fact that they love me because I love them so much, too. And I'm going to miss them during the summertime. I'm probably going to be, like, emailing parents throughout the week, like, throughout the year, summer, like, hey, tell Kaya say hey, or tell such and such I say hey, is camera still bad? <laughs> but there's that. And then, just to close out from everything else of course as you know it i'm tara j and don't forget to subscribe to my channel beautiful people and all of my teachers again i hope you had a great teachers appreciation week because i sure did too especially the people that are experiencing it for the very first time you are awesome just like me i love you guys peace